Oh, hey, welcome back to let me move that Skyblock. Uh, this thing, one fifteen <laughs> four, one in a hut. Um, what? Nothing. Just series of random numbers. Yeah, seventeen. Whatever. I don't know. Uh, so unrelated to the game, I got my new trackball. Uh, just now. Had it plugged in for a bit, it doesn't work that way, but also I, it's charged now, so it's apparently one one minute of charging gives you a day of use, and then that sticks around for like four months, so that's cool. Um, ice thing's working. It, not probably right now, because we're way over here, but if we're in the area, then it's, it's fine. Um, I'm thinking we... we <clears throat> since we have bamboo, there's no reason to have the fishery in the jungle anymore. So, A, let's go ahead and move that over here, and to do... I, the problem is it's, like, slightly encased in glass. We have nothing resembling silk touch. Might be able to catch it. Then we'd need an anvil, so that's its own problem. But let's go ahead and grab... I guess I have some of this... Dis oh, wow, well, okay. I've been dialing in the... This is actually not as fast as it goes. I can get from here to the... Uh, whole, all the way past... That's the midpoint, and then the whole other screen in... Uh, you know, just sliding the thing, it's cool. So I'm trying to I'm trying to get used to this. I'll eventually kick it up all the way because that's gonna help me a lot. And then there's a button that I can do this and eh, so I, you know if I'm using Lightwave or Photoshop or something I can dial it in and get a lot tighter with it. Um I'm gonna make some glass. Okay. I'm gonna go uh, grab what we can retain of oh you might wanna come with me, I don't know how much stuff is in the box. It might be something I can't all carry. We don't have any backpacks yet, obviously. Um, as far as the existing glass, I mean, I guess if we really cared, it's not hurting anything. We just leave it there. Oh, well, no, we have infinite of water. It doesn't matter. I just realized I don't have a bucket handy to I can just pick this up. But I guess I can just do this with it. No, I can't. I can just do this with it. It's really hard to do that with uh, a block like that. Uh, there's stuff in there if you want to grab. I mean, I can pick that up. I've got room because I've got a slot for it. Pick this up and see what happens. Oh, I'm good. Pick that up because obviously we could use that kind of thing. Leave the uh, glass in place, because why not? That's basically the... Yeah, we can come back later for this with Soap Touch. We'll have it one day. Um, and then we'll have more glass here as the oven makes it happen. Uh, give me... Uh, well, I'm going to want that. Give me that, and that is the first part of putting this thing together. What do you want this? It's going to be largely you. I don't care. Okay. Well, I know you want it to be not under an overhang, or it won't work as well. Right. So, I guess if we have it... There's... Everything can be... Well, actually, the one thing we can't move right now is the portal to the nether. But, generally, we can move stuff around if we want to. Like, and also, again, later. Yeah, you've got a lot of stuff. I'm happy there. enough... I'm happy enough with the tree being right there, so let's just figure that's going to stay where it is. That's... Sunset, so it seems logical if we set this up here, and I guess I'll just do it about the same way. Then uh, you can stare forward and see that the sun is setting right behind you as the beds. Right. So that'll be cool uh, to work. Uh, throw this down real quick. Give me that and put it there. And I think probably I can uh, put the water in here as needed. Uh, let's see where we are on available glass, because that's kind of how we're going to... It doesn't even have to be glass, it just looks better, and I think 16 is a good start. Okay, wake up. And, uh, can just sleep in a sec also. Put down, uh, like this for sure. We can build this up, bulk it up later, kind of. Um, probably like this, and like that. I think that's good enough. I guess if we lose a torch, I'll know I was wrong. Yeah, that's pretty good. And from here, let's build up. 
You want to stand on the box for a sec? Okay. So, what did I just, I went up two, right? Yeah. Yeah, so one more should be right, because I can't get this back if I get it wrong. This allows you to exist in here and under that. We're worried eventually we could uh, uh, build it out a bit more, have like a door so that if there's monsters they can't get you, but I don't think I would, there shouldn't be monsters. Get in here, so sleep. <clears throat> and um, no, let me get back over there. Was okay, let me out. Uh, wherever I just put that exactly. Here's this. That is technically complete. Um, here's that, and that is enough for like seven rods. More than I mean, the sticks are anyway. That stuff that we've caught, we'll just throw it in there. Is stuff that we've caught. Um, this, I'm getting to the point that I wouldn't hate having a couple of these on me, so let me, yep, still getting used to the mouse, I'll be alright, um, that goes there, and you can just have that to assemble whatever, it's not an anvil, so you can't, you can't, uh, if you catch like a mending rod and then also a lure rod, go with the lure, or go with the mending, because it'll last forever and we'll just have to wait. Incidentally, about anvils and whatever, I've been swatting away. I got some. That's uh, a, a percentage of it, a fair percentage, is. Mo I just melted all of the uh, gold armor we got. I also melted some of the uh, iron armor that we got. So we have eight ingots right now. I'm keeping this. I don't know why. I just am. Uh, so we have eight iron ingots, and we have in the world uh, two hoppers, I think. Sounds right. You know, which is something to work with. Mm -hmm. That was really stupid. I'm going to put the water away because I was wrong. Um, give me... We'll work on the sand thing. You know, the, that. Down right. there. Try to get a better one happening for now. I just want some more glass. Um... Give me this, give me this, give me that. Give me uh, uh, that real quick. Get this out of my way because it's dangerous. I'm just going to make that not water for a sec. Um, and then let's, uh, what's in here? Oh, yuck. All right, prepare for... An explosion and some picking up of lots of things. Uh, that doesn't have to be here anymore. Did I get? Oh, I guess I had room. Where do we want? If the fishery's right, th actually, it's not really the worst place for this. It's just I don't like the design. But we could build. I'm trying to think how much room I really need. Let me build. Let me put this down and make this work. Let me have. Damn it. Let me think. Uh, yeah, I just tear this down while I'm thinking, because it's just bugging me. Um, part of what's wrong with this is it gets in the way, and I can't really tell where it stops and something else begins, and it's just awkward. That could probably be filled in. Oh, that could really be full. I didn't even realize that was open. All right, so <clears throat> where do you want a generator, do you think? I really don't know. Well, I wonder in part because you have this habit of just when I'm doing stuff that needs to be done that takes understanding of things. You just wander off and do this sort of thing. You go fishing or hit to get cobblestone or chop the tree down or whatever. Pretty happy with where the tree is. That can just stay there. Uh, it's not really something that you can, you know, see around, so. Yeah, that's the problem. I'm going to leave that there. Do I have any ladders from doing all that? Yeah. 
kind of easy way to at some point I'll water lift that, but for now I just don't really have the I don't have the ice and I won't have to not have the ice, it's a thing. That can go in there for now. That can go in that can go in hanging onto the glass for reasons. Um So okay. So if we set up uh I mean I'm fine with it having it all central, but I just, I don't want it too close to something it can set on fire, because there was lava. Right. And I'm trying to decide. We should really widen these and build more, by the way. Right. So that we're not just trying to balance. Let's just put it over here, why not? So, in putting it over here, we put down a... I guess I'll just figure we won't have that torch there. Let's put down a box right here. A hopper right here, and here's where it's going to get ugly because it's a thing. Well, actually, I can just say that it was perfect to leave that there. It's fine. In fact, I'm going to put one here, too. Those will be hoppers one day for now. We couldn't do it if I wanted to, but we, there's just no practical reason to make a 3D hopper. We can fix it. We can add them in later. <clears throat> and with that done... Let me... I'm pretty sure I know what I want, but let me just build this out in a way that I can fix, you know, ultimately. And we'll replace these with glass if we need to, or get rid of them entirely. So that's going to be the major water source, first of all. Which means, yeah, these are going to be glass. And that's going to be replaced now. Do I have any sticks anywhere in the world? Not exactly. Um, yeah, so, and we'll save those for later. Um, yeah, so let's go break this out. Actually, I might, if I can leave that, I'll, I'll figure it out in a sec. That's going to be glass because it's going to be permanent, so... Glass goes there, and there, and there, and there, and there, and there. There's actually going to be water on all of this. Uh, knowing that, let's go ahead and... I'm pretty sure I'm right. Just put this here. And, you know, worst case, I waste some glass and we just get it back later. So it's fine. And here, and here, and here, and then how's that look from angle where I can tell what's happening. Oh, that can't be torches. I mean, I guess it could be, but it's not going to be. It'll be this. And then we'll replace that with poppers, because like, if it's torches, it'll just wash away. Um, need glass or something, at least, back here to retain what we're going to have. And yeah, it doesn't have to be glass, but it looks really neat when it's made of glass, so I mean, that's why it's, it's worth it. That is, let me put down more torches so I have a place to put things. That would be glass, and that would be glass. This is going to, I just had something too. This would be, uh, give me that. That's pretty tough and not something you're going to confuse with anything. This can go... If I put it here, actually, let's do exactly that. Give me all this. Wait, is that a, that's an upper slab. Well, whatever, we'll figure it out. So if you sneak in here, you can just stand in your, sheltered from, um, from uh, phantoms. The downside now is that you're also again, inviting things to, let me think. Put them here. That would make sense. Alright, so with that in place, I need this for a sec. I just put that down in exactly the wrong place, but it's fine. I'll fix it. Grab this. Get, was that more bamboo on the ground? Probably. Okay. Some more sticks. 
<coughs> put uh, put water in the corner, which is what I actually wanted, and then pick that back up and corner and pick up and corner and it's all sorts of stuff. So that's a good start. Do not put lava in there. Um, put torches here. And we're just going to throw glass here, which will protect the water beneath the glass, and you'll be able to see it. It's kind of the visible uh, generator. With that done, I'm going to put glass there because I don't want the stuff leaking out the side. Apparently, I'm going to put it there. And if I just put this right here, that will hit that, become stone, spread out, become stone, and that's all you can see it. Uh, and then we just cover this up because there's no good reason to leave it open. Let me move something. I don't want that right now. Just seal it this way. And I'm going to double check and see if I just made not a huge mistake, but an annoying problem to deal with. Get these torches out of here because they're not really part of this. You don't need them. And it just clutters things. And then uh, if we go around, that doesn't belong there. If we go around the back, uh, yeah, I can get in there. I can, you know, if I do it, well, I can do it now because it's safe for the moment. But I can throw in, I'm going to have to use a trap door to get small enough, but ultimately I can uh, put two more hoppers in there when we're ready for that. I'll put that in there for now because otherwise it's going to be a problem. Take a nap real quick. Hey. You get anything? Nemo fish, mm. which doesn't matter. Mm. Villagers buy those now. Not that we have villagers. Um, I'm gonna get my water back because I kind of like having that. And I'm gonna put the glass in here. I think oh, I have some. I have one. And now, if you're over here, you can uh, kind of slink in. And this is actually just like 1% easier to go through than cobblestone when, you, when you're when you drilling at it. Mm. So I'll probably actually get two right away, but one of them will just almost certainly be engulfed by lava. Let's check. I almost got three. But then once it really picks up and it's... Oh, that was weird. Um, that happens sometimes when the lava comes in. Or the... When the lava drips down before the water comes in, it can happen. So there's that. You're under a thing that no uh, phantoms can hear about you. You're the thing that prevents spawning on top. And we have okay. torches. And we have uh, cobblestone collecting in there from that first hopper. Later, we'll have two more hoppers. So that first one would have been, you know, gone into. And if you hit this with, like, say you have a diamond pickaxe with efficiency 5, I think we can get up to. You'll just tear through all three. The good news is that when you tear through all three, because you could conceivably get all three and still be going before any came back, but one, two, three, four, five, you'll never actually hit unless something glitches, which I have had happen. You'll never hit this glass with a pickaxe if you're in front of... I mean, the reason it could happen is that technically this is like one molecule, well, one Minecraft pixel, really, in if you were back just a bit, which you could be, just keep an eye on. But that way, if you tear it through all three, which I won't do with this, but um, you could actually hit the glass. If you do, uh, well, half the time, I'll say more than half the time, because this is a stone generator, you'd be hitting this with soap touch and then get stone. But if we just want cobblestone, I guess be careful. If you do hit the glass, just go around and get it and put it back. It is simple enough, but this is a lot more efficient. There's, Well, what we had until just now was actually pretty good. Everything would just go straight down the hopper. But this has no choice but to. There's nowhere it can go but the hopper. At, at worst, it might go to the side somehow, go into the water, and just probably put, be pushed right back because the water has to push from the sides to fill in the water gap. It's not a problem. I guess the lava could maybe, I don't know, it doesn't matter. I would say it's like 99.9% .9 lossless. So that gives us that. <coughs> um, gonna throw these in here, I guess, because I don't want them on me. 
grab the glass that we now have made. So we have more glass than I needed, but then again, we have glass. So there's that. We, when we want glass things, and we will. Um, annoyingly, sand is good to have. You put, you know, cactus on it, whatever. But you melt it into glass and have glass. A reason to have glass is when we build a village, I intend to make it out of probably glass. <clears throat> to prevent spawning of anything. Not monsters, not iron guys, nothing. So it's going to be uh, like 1,200 blocks of glass, roughly. I mean, not exactly, but around that. It's going to be a lot. It's going to be 20 stacks of, of glass cubes, basically. Which is ambitious, but it's how it's going to be. Uh, once we have a village established, we can get uh, librarians in there who we can buy glass from. And given what else we can do with librarians, money is never going to be a problem in this map. It will be fine. It's never a problem in any map. Money's easy. Emeralds, easy to come by. So, you know, that's, I don't know where I'm going to put that. We could probably, any time we could start on building the damn thing, but it, until we have at least, you know, I've got to know something. Give me some blocks. I really, I been meaning to find this out and I keep not doing it. I want to know if that is in fact mushrooms. It's got to be. What else could it be? I guess. Let's go find it. What time is it? Noon? Or Ten? Something. Let's go figure out where is the path over here? Is it here? Yeah. So that's like five again. Alright. It's always on five. I don't know why. So it's right behind this in fact. <clears throat> so let's go find out if this is this just gets us another, uh, I hope it's a mushroom island biome, that'd be awesome. My new mouse is really clicky. The other one was just kind of like, eh. Like the one I just replaced, the right mouse button. The one I replaced a couple days ago, the right mouse button just puked. It died. It didn't work at all. So, but I had another... Logitech M570, and you know, so I just moved on to yeah, that. The, uh, but the, it was just annoying me. And I, this is the newer, whatever is it, what model is this? It's the MX Ergo. Okay, so this is neat. I like it. The uh, the the clicky bits mm -hmm. on the the old Logitech trackballs, it was it was notoriously cheap. I'm getting that. Um, well, I mean, it was okay for however many years. I was replacing them annually, semi-annually, maybe. So, you know. And they were, what, 60 bucks each-ish? Uh, initially? Sometimes, sometimes less if you found them at the right place. Yeah. So, 100 bucks a year on those. Okay. And then this just kind of was about 100 and if it lasts more than a year, I'm pretty happy. And then I'll either get another one of these if I decide I've liked it, or see what exists at the time. I don't care. Whatever. I don't expect anything to last anymore. Just funny because, I mean, in the house I've got like a, an Apple II Plus from 1979. It still works. I mean, probably. I guess I haven't tried it since like the Y2K thing, but I'm pretty sure it was safe because, for one thing, it was Apple. It wasn't really the part of that convention. You've got a... a Commodore, mm -hmm. not really a laptop that's. Yeah, the works. SX64. Yeah. And that thing has like a real old style screen in it. Yeah, it's a little, it's a 5 inch CRT, so it's the size of a. If a smartphone were 4x3, that's what it would be the size of. Instead, it's the size of one and a half of those, basically. Did I see mountains? What, what did I see mountains? I don't know, I thought I saw mountains. I was wrong. That is mushrooms. I'm so pleased. Okay. I think you've also got like a Dell or something somewhere in the office. That I have two, and they convinced me that I hate Dell. It's like a. Really I haven't old... bought a Dell since the mid '90s. It's like a really old laptop. Oh yeah, it's a it's a it's an eight oh four eighty six. It at was the new point... model, so at the time it was about uh, seven or eight thousand bucks. I've also somewhere got a Toshiba. 286 that I got wholesale for eight because I was in a position to just, I was like, I'm going to resell it, and I didn't. I kept it. It's fine. Shut up. List on that thing was in Mushroom Fields. Uh, was was a lot. It was like ten or 12,000. 
But it was back when no one had a laptop. You needed, you know, if you needed a laptop, it wasn't because I oh, shall have a laptop. I was like, hey, look, I'm important. Is there you actually worry into? There was a reason. You're you're spending more on a laptop than a car cost at the time. I mean, some cars. Um, that's mushrooms. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a couple of these and grab these because these will probably grow their way back in theoretically mm. and how well it doesn't really matter is this is, we could technically link dirt if we wanted to but this being what it is we could get mushroom cows here I assume it's a grid again which would probably be a reason to put down more dirt you certainly could do that and since it's a mushroom biome these torches are needless yeah let's do that what, what time is it yeah we got five minutes let's do that I don't care about this like, what did I do? Okay. Like, a so name tag. I can't hear you. Oh, I just, I caught a name tag. Okay. Yeah, we could go ahead and dirt that up a bit just to build out the, the um, area. Just get to the edge of the grid with it and we'll be fine. Even replace the cobblestone I just put down to get to it, to that point. Let me store these mushrooms so we, uh, we never get a creeper anywhere near a seed vault. There's right now. There's no reason to think it would happen, but that doesn't help me much when it could happen. Put these where I want them. Get some dirt. Uh, a grid is 16 squares. So that's really just a stack of. No, it's not. 16 squared is 256. Never mind. I think. I don't know. It sounds like it is. <sighs> Four sixteen sixty four two fifty six. Yeah. Why not? We'll say that's what you know I'll know more in a minute. I'm gonna be over here where it doesn't matter if the sun sets. Ha 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 ha. I'm following. Yeah, it's probably wise. Well, we just slept, so we're good. Let me have this and I'll know where I am. So I want to uh, have this too just to make sure I'm not wrong. Plains, mushroom fields, yeah. So if we just dirt this up to the edge of the biome, which, what the hell? That's not the edge of the biome. This is. I thought it was over there. It's not a rectangle, I thought it was. Huh. Well, so dig that up because it doesn't help us. That this is mushroom. I don't know what the hell that was about. Okay, so this doesn't help me. I'll just have to eyeball it. Um, this is planes. It's like diagonal or something stupid. I don't know. What happens over here? Okay. It's weird. And then it's really wide. Because this is way beyond. Well, it's slightly beyond. Okay, whatever. Um, this is mushroom, and I guess we'll make sure that it's all... We'll have to put in something that prevents spawning if there's suddenly a, a block in here that's planes or something. Mushroom. Where where are you? Uh, here. Go ahead and take that. You can do what I'm doing. You see what the point is? Yeah. Mushroom. 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 It's a snake. Badger. Hmm. That's weird that the. I thought it was a rect uh, square. Well, rectangle. Squares are rectangles in okay. the strictest sense. There are subspecies. That's where it changes to tiger. Mm -hmm. It does? Yeah. Okay. Then we're not just all planes, but for this stuff, which is what my assumption has been to date. Oh, lost that. Yeah. Lost what? A bit of dirt. Okay. We can get more. It's just gravel. We'll get it. That's mushrooms. I assume this is all mushrooms. Mushrooms. 
here, and if I back up and then it's still planes over here, though. Okay. okay. Huh. I wonder whether that's strange. I really thought it was going to be planes over there. That is Tiger 2. This is all. Nope, that's, that's planes. Tiger. What's this? Mushroom, and this is mushroom. This is just bizarre. <coughs> Beach. Well, why not? Taiga. Yeah. Strange. Mushroom. Taiga. Mushroom. Taiga. Mushroom. I don't know. That's just. I don't even know what to make of any of this. This What's left to worry about that whole side? Mushroom. You know what? That's cool. Let's just leave it at work out of time. Mushroom. Right? Yeah. Mushroom. We'll work on it. There's no relief. It's not that fascinating. If once we have it, we'll have a shape. Or just next, you know, sometime we can mention what it actually turned out to be. So we'll get out of here. Let this the mycelium can uh, spread, and we'll probably get cows and stuff like that. And we'll just see you next time. So, bye.